Hi students, I'm Paul Vardikto. In today's class, we'll learn about conditional statements. Conditional statements are used when a decision has to be taken. For example, while writing results, a teacher has two possible results, pass and fail. But the decision has to be made by the teacher based on the student's mark. Likewise, in programming, if you wish PHP to make decisions on your data, you should use conditional statements. Generally, there are four different conditional statements. They are if, if else, if else, if else and switch. Let's see what if statement is. To check whether a person is eligible to get license or not, the age value of the person should be more than 18. So to get output on this, the person's age should be compared with 18 and then the result should be produced. Let's try to write code for this. First, we'll declare the age and license age variables. I'm declaring the age variable as 23 and license variable as 18. Then we'll give the condition. Inside condition, we I'm writing age greater than license age. And in echo statement, I'm giving the word eligible. Now my program will read my age value and the age value will be compared with license age. As the age value given is greater than license age, the output will be printed as eligible. If I change my age value as 13, there won't be any output as I have not mentioned what to do when my condition fails. Now I wish I should get not eligible as output if the given person's age is less than 18. In such cases, I can use if else statement. In if else statement, if the condition is true, if block will be executed. If the condition is false, else block will be executed. Now the same code as if statement is used but here we'll add else block as we need an alternative output if the condition fails. In the else block, I'm giving echo statement for not eligible. If I give age as 12, now I'll get the output as not eligible. Now else block will get executed as the condition is false. If the age is set as 29, the output will be eligible and that time if block will be executed. In certain cases, two or more conditions has to be checked. In such cases, if else if else statements will be used. Here, a teacher wants to check whether the student has got first class marks or second class marks or failed marks. To get output for this, the teacher has to check two conditions. So in this case, the teacher can use if else if else statements. Let's try to write a code for this problem. First, we will declare student marks variable, pass mark variable and first class mark variable. In first condition, student's mark will be checked whether it's greater than first class marks or not. If the condition gets true, first class will be printed as output. If the condition goes false, else block condition will be checked. The second condition is whether the student's mark is greater than pass mark or not. If the condition goes true, second class will be printed as output and if the condition gets fail, fail will be printed as output. If a user needs many different conditions to be checked, switch statements can be used. Switch statement uses a switch function variable which will be compared with every condition inside switch function and whichever condition that matches the switch function variable will be executed. That's all for today's class. For more lectures on 12th standard computer application, subscribe and follow Hard Drive channel. Thank you.